Makerere University Academic Staff Association has changed leadership and Dr. Deos Kamonyo is the new chairperson of the association. I, De Dr. Deos Kamonyo. Dr. Kamonyo takes office at a time when the academic staff at Uganda's so, oldest university are agitating for better pay and improved welfare. When you undermine one professor, you undermine all of us. You undermine our integrity. You belittle us in the face of those who respect us. And you do not, know, you do, not do any good to us. During the handover ceremony, the outgoing chairperson, Dr. Mahmoud Chigundu, was praised for saving 18 billion Ugandan shillings in investments and introducing a health insurance policy for the university's academic staff. Because as I hand over, our 15 is not yet here. And we have to work with you, the Minister of Education, to make sure that the 15 comes to the professor. We found a professor earning 2.4 million, and now we are leaving them in the science space at 8.9. The handover of the new committee to the Mwasa Association comes at a time when Makerere is preparing for its 60th graduation this week. Their main task will be to lobby for better salaries and better welfare. While Makerere doesn't have these amounts of money, they hope to raise it through increasing tuition per student. The investigation report says we should charge unit cost, which I think was the first thing that the president said on 29th. If these people are, being, are paying little money, let them pay for the unit cost. He said in the past the unit cost was not well calculated. Now it has been calculated. So when you increase tuition, he said in his words, those who can afford will go to Makerere. Those who can't afford will go to other universities. The University Vice Chancellor Professor Banabas Nawangwe warned that while they were agitating for better pay, they should refrain from absconding from work. A lot of our members of staff are working very hard, some collapsing on the job. But there are others, and we have started finding them out and weeding them out, who are working elsewhere, enjoying themselves, and we are blindly paying a salary and paying an insert for somebody who has never even stepped here. Mwasa, which currently represents over 1,000 academic staff, has been engaged in a series of standoffs with the government over its members' welfare in the last few years. It remains to be seen how the new leadership will deliver on the demands of the association's members. Andranitwe, NTV, Makere University.